upper floors. I don't really care about the curtained windows. No curtains on these. Yeah, Nightbot's out of date now. We just start up a brand new one. I should probably get that fixed. Give me one second here. I'll go fix that. <clears throat> what do I call this? Um, Netic Downward Necro? <laughs> Too long. Whoops. The heck? Hmm. Close my window. Weird. This one was called Wizard's Vacation, something like that. for now um i think the mods stayed the same gotta fix this <laughs> all right we kept city size spacing i think all that that came 2010 instead of 1020 There we go. I think it's all fixed up. <clears throat> all right, so we're just in the early, early stage investigating the island, investigating our tower, seeing what options we've got available to us and what we can accomplish before we have to leave. I got very little in the way of food. We got only the basic raw materials to do any kind of crafting with. We got the basic tools already. So we've got the uh, lock picks, crowbar, screwdriver, hammer. With the addition of a wood saw, um, we got a decent amount of carry volume, especially with the sling pack, but that'll be dangerous if I get in any kind of trouble. So i got to decide how long we're going to spend here on the island. It's a foot race. The genetic downward spiral is going to start kicking in, and weird things, bad things are going to start happening, so I can't spend too long here. Um, we need to raise our magic abilities and raise our cooking level and try to get to uh, purifier potions as quickly purifier serums as quickly as possible so through a combination of magic and um mutagens we're gonna see if we can keep this guy alive but <laughs> he's gonna die horribly we have no combat abilities no uh speedy movements all we have is night vision basically 
and uh, whatever magic we can bring to bear. So, yeah. Low stats, except for intelligence. It's going to be somewhat interesting. But i got to decide how long we're going to spend here. Um, the good news is I don't yet have um, Imperceptive Healer or anything like that. Let's see. What do I want from up here? I want anything at the moment. Now we do have the tools to deconstruct. So we take that apart. It does have two pipes and a bunch of planks. Hmm. I also do have Z levels on, so I could uh, haul up and down stairs. Alright, oops. Gotta decide if I want to set up down here or set up upstairs one level. So we've got the uh, fireplace right here, and I've got a table so I can craft and uh, all that good stuff. Food's going to be the issue. Food is going to be right away the issue. What do we got? right i need that to start fires i don't have uh i don't have a fire source <coughs> i'm only gonna be able to use that during daylight hours hmm yeah that's gonna be issue number one is uh, an early fire source eggs blue half a year down <laughs> thank you very much for the resub appreciate that you having a good Monday. All right, let's uh, get those red real quick. I have no idea how long it takes to uh, row a canoe. I've never been in a boat in this game, so no idea. Um, this may or may not be just a teeny tiny island. It might be. It says island on these two spaces, but um, yeah. I don't know if that's true. Don't the prison islands usually have a shoreline within reach of swimming? So were I to go somewhere, I would probably go that way first. Hmm. But yeah, so this is my entire food supply. Some of which is frozen. <laughs> Let's, uh... Firewood source over there. But I think, I think, I think, I think a punk. Activate. Need direct sunlight. So I gotta be, I think that means I gotta be outside. <laughs> I think that's what it's telling me. Hmm. 
I think the bigger question is, am I am I gonna make any attempt to stay on this island? Rolling back and forth is gonna be a ridiculous pain in the ass. Or do I just um try to stay alive long enough? Excuse me. <laughs> do I try to stay alive long enough to uh, get a couple of levels of tailoring and then um get a backpack, grab my stuff and get out of here? Yeah, I don't know where the shoreline is yet. <laughs> I don't know how long it's going to take me to, uh, to to row the boat. I should probably go out and test the boat rowing. See how that whole process works. Get that figured out. I think I've got everything gathered in one place that I consider of use. Only other place was the bedrooms, which other than some raw materials, rags from some of the beds, and wood from the other furnishings, or a couple of pipes. Not really much up here. The curtains for the string... So, 3 out of 15 currently. Got um, no abilities that's going to make crafting faster. My intelligence. Tailoring one, super, super simple and fast. Tailoring one to two is not too bad, but I'm worried about it getting nighttime before I can even get to, um, well, at two, I can get a duffel bag. All I need to do is get to two. Hmm. Yeah, the lack of the fire source is what's really going to hurt. Technically, I can make fire with a magnifying glass outside. I also have no liquid storage capability. And I got the glass flasks and the pickles and the veggies. So yeah, I actually do have liquid storage. Pretty easily take just about everything that I need to with me already. Alright, let's go uh let's go see what this whole rowing thing is about. <laughs> see how fast we can row, how much time it takes. I don't have the faintest. I've never done any boat stuff in the game. So I'm kinda curious. Also, does it take stamina? What, what, what's it gonna take? I have no no swimming skill whatsoever. If we hop in the back of the boat. Vehicle controls are here. Alright. Canoe is ready for movement. You take control. Does it act like just any other kind of vehicle? Safe speed. 100% off road. <laughs> Water safe, 9. Water acceleration, 2. Cargo volume. Oh, 50 liters of cargo. Well, yeah, we can we can definitely go traveling then. All right, not too bad. I think I'm going to go back and get my stuff. I'm going to get the stuff. We'll load this thing up. But I want to go three miles per hour. I don't want to go four miles per hour. All right, so the volume is probably what from the two seats, <laughs> twenty-five liters each. Yep. All right, so let's um, leave that stuff here for now.
Okay. Uh, let's assume we're going to take all the food and the books. Leave behind the random crap. Take the rope. And the string. rest of this basic stuff I can get about anywhere. So, yeah, I think that's all I care about. Crowbar, hammer, screwdriver, and knife. All right, we're out of here. I'm still uh, leaning towards heading up and kind of going around the prison. I, I want to say there's going to be coastline up here. I thought most of the prisons I've seen have been within swimming distance of the coastline. So of my two choices, I think I'm going to go that way first. Oh, we're out in the scary deep water with zero swimming skill. Damn ducks polluting the water. Like some shallows. <laughs> what I thought was going to be the uh, the coastline turns out to be a one space, <laughs> a one space island. Uh, all right, Let's see if we can uh, paddle our boat close enough to the island to get shot by a long range turret. The problem here is going to be. Zombie brutes are going to try to swim out my way, and if I sit still, they'll pop up out of the water, Jason Voorhees style, and try to try to get me. Actually, what am I looking at here? Just a table. Playing some sticks. Nothing else. Still nothing inside. Ooh-wee. <laughs> Whoa, 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 I think I broke it. Oh, don't, don't break it. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, man. So much for the prisons being in swimming distance of the shoreline. Oh, another, another possibility. <laughs> we got the raft not sure why we have lake shore but uh, no shore <laughs> huh oh actually we do have some shore That is, um, yeah, that would be, that would be quite the island to try to swim away from. At least we got a swamp. We got something new. So did the uh, wizard tower thing <laughs> break map gen? Is, is that what's happening? Is that what I'm seeing here? Am I seeing just broken map gen because of the requirements for the Wizard Tower Island? Because this is getting kind of ridiculous.
Oh, maybe. Maybe! <laughs> I think we got some land finally. Once it turned out to be just a big island. Pretty good size island if it is one. Alright, so we started way the hell over here. I'm just going to keep going down the coast. <clears throat> see what we see. More little islands. That's just ridiculous. I'm actually going to curve back over. I'm more interested in verifying how big this stupid lake is than anything else. Oh, that's right. I did drop that watch. Ten a.m. All right. Not, not too much time's going by while we paddle around. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, this this is just ridiculous. <laughs> well, that's kind of funny. <laughs> Gee. <laughs> I think we have a central lab complex. <laughs> Look for the manhole cover. Where's the manhole cover? It's probably going to be buried in the woods there. <laughs> uh, see if I get shot through the ground. Nothing else showing up on the map yet. I'm, I'm betting Central Lab Complex. That would be hilarious to stumble into right off the bat. All right, we got to hop out and take a look. Whoa. Damn it. Well, now I have a problem. <laughs> it drifted onto the ground. Uh, can't move it. Stop driving. Sure. Grab. Whoops. Grab. Alright. Okay. Um yeah, let's let's look for the central lab complex entrance. Or is there gonna be an actual lab somewhere? Given where we're seeing the gunfire. I think we're gonna find somewhere in here. Maybe Nick's down by the, uh... Oh, we got a zombie. Woo, zombie right here. Crap, I can't fight nothing. Um... I've got my knife. So many hits needed. All right, this is this is gonna suck. 
farm. Not seeing what I'm looking for. How far off are we? Looks like I got most of the shady areas filled in. See it. Oh. Up the trail real quick. Skitterbot. Skitterbot. <laughs> uh. Uh. Skitterbot. Um, hmm. and he knows where I'm at. Forty-seven away. That is that is some vision. Hmm. That is some bad news there. Well, hmm. what to do here? Gonna be death by early skitterbot. North and below. Fire again, turret. Likely where I need to be is where that uh, skitterbot was just at. Hopefully, it's investigating noises. This is going to be a big waste of my time probably trying to do this. <laughs> um... Stay on the path. <laughs> From the southwest and below, I'm hearing gunfire. Oh man, this is going to be ridiculous. This thing is going to be so huge. So we're at the inter intersection of the paths. Well, I'm seeing even more gunfire down this way. So it's stretching from up here all the way down to here. I'm still thinking it's the entrance is going to be somewhere in this batch up north of me. Unfortunately, around where the skitterbot was at. What I'm looking for is a manhole cover, by the way. <laughs> if anybody's curious what the hell I'm doing, I'm looking for a manhole cover. It's the only entrance. The only, the only indication is just one tiny little manhole cover sitting in the middle of the forest. 
So we're kind of rolling around, trying to fill in as much of the map memory and work my way around these trees as much as possible so I can kind of scan the area after I've kind of circled it and look for the manhole cover. Um, I think I'm going to need to angle back up north now. Getting in and staying alive would be hugely helpful for this guy, which is the main reason I'm trying to pursue this. It's the only explanation for what I'm seeing with the uh, the, the turrets. I just really wish there wasn't a skitter bot somewhere in the area. Northwest and below. He's coming for me. That's what I didn't want. Um, it's kind of where I started up that way. Plus, it's still hiding in the shady areas that I haven't quite uncovered yet. I'm still not seeing it. Problem is the uh, the complex is so massive that the, the land area that it could be under is just humongous. I mean, look at this! <laughs> look at this! Ugh. All right. Well, first things first. Oh, this skitter bot's gonna get me. I'm assuming necrotic gaze is not gonna help with a skitter bot. I'm hoping my uh, stamina lasts till I can get to the boat before the Skitterbot gets on me. I see you back there, Skitterbot. Skitterbot and a oh, fungal zombie. Ugh. Well, that's not cool. <laughs> Here we go again. <coughs> Hmm. Your bot's going after the fungal zombie. I don't think the fungal zombie can hurt the skitter bot. Yeah, it can't. I want to see if the skitter bot comes and tries to swim in the water. Yep. <laughs> oh, you're just going to hang out in the shallow? Hmm. All right, you want to follow me up this way? <laughs> Dang it, look at these. This thing is now spread from what? Here down to here. <laughs> it's it's in a it's in a box like this. 
And I have no idea if the um, the entrance is generally centered in the area where you hear turrets, or if it could be offset entirely. <laughs> now we got shock blasts going off. Oh, this is ridiculous. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we just got uh, ramp. Oh, oh, oh. What are we seeing here? Hmm. Airdrop crates. All right, time to uh, park again. So, we've got a turret right below us. MREs. Any other crates? Yep. Lots more crates. Oh, backpack. Winter jackets. <laughs> Smoke bomb and senior grenade, huh? How about a gun? MBR vest with steel and a tactical dump pouch. Sure, more the merrier. Load me up. All right, so I might have to give up my search. <laughs> there's no other explanation. There's definitely, there's definitely a, a, a central lab complex, which is the super lab. I've never actually found one during a live stream. And I've, I've done one or two live streams. I, I've, I've got a couple hours, five or six hours over on my YouTube channel of, of Cataclysm. And um, never once actually managed to come across one. Still not seeing the manhole cover that denotes the, uh, the entrance. And it's going to be such a pain in the ass to try to track down in this big forest area. Let's go back up to the boat, drop a few things, and, um, whoops, Skitterbot. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> he's, he's, he's out in the deep water? Behind me? Um, that's not where I expected him to be. Can he actually move towards me? I think he's stuck. I don't think he's allowed to move in the deep water spot there. I, I think that's a different Skitterbot. I think stuff is spontaneously teleporting up, up a level from the uh, lower area. Alright, let's uh, drop that stuff. And... <laughs> like that. <laughs> uh, it's even worse, apparently, with Z-Levels on. The teleporting from lower levels is, is even worse. I got pretty annoyed when it was doing it uh, with Z-Levels off, but now we're seeing it just all over the place with Z-Levels on. So, I'm already uh, annoyed with Z-Levels. I'm pretty tempted to... I, I, I just don't get how how could this thing possibly be this big? I mean, yeah, I, I guess it's technically it's uh, that's I don't know what's going on. <clears throat> yeah, I, I don't know what's going on.
I would love to get into it, but uh, I just don't think I'm going to find the entrance. The area is just too big. I found one when I was just roaming around in a test world once and I was setting up for some other or a video I was doing. And um Yeah, it was just a manhole cover. Um But this is just the area is just too big. And with all the trees constantly blocking lines of sight, I there's uh, just no way. For all I know, the damn entrance is underwater. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna have to pass this up, unfortunately. I'm so tempted though to, to reveal the map and then go down a level just so I can see where it's at and verify that it is what I think it is. Can I see if there's a diamond tree formation? I, I have no idea what that means. I don't know what you're talking about with the diamond tree formation. No, I don't think map notes denotes the uh, the entrance. I, I don't know 100%, but... Given, I mean, we came all the way down here, and we were still hearing gunfire down this far. So I, I don't honestly think it's a, it's underwater. We're hearing some gunfire out here. I think the lab might extend out to the water, but I think the entrance is somewhere in here. I just, I, I, <laughs> I don't know if I can stand to spend the time to actually go try to find it. The one time I did find it in my test world, it was right along the side of a path. So that's why I ran down this path real quick, trying to hope to see if it was down here. We'll give it one more attempt. I'll, I'll try one more time to hop out and find it. I can hear lots of zombies. See the gunfire. Um, let's let's follow the path to the west first. See if the gunfire continues to. <laughs> expand to the west. Hopefully I don't run into a critter that's going to end me here. I heard any gunfire recently. Not afraid of a moose. Hey there, shotgun hull. Yeah, we haven't heard anything for quite a while, so I think we're west and maybe even south. Let's go ahead and work our way back up this way. And then unfortunately I'm gonna have to long range I can't I can't see it from this far out. I don't think I'll be able to notice it reliably, so I have to scan from about this range. Means I have to pan my screen back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. All right, so southernmost gunfire I saw was down here. So I'm gonna come straight across, and then we'll we'll, we'll just kind of peek our way north and south a bit, I guess. All right, so now we're hearing it way down there. We're hearing it way over here now. <laughs> Maybe the uh, the manhole covers out here in the open. That would be cool. Either black rats. But, I mean, I'm already thirsty. I don't have anything to drink, so we're gonna have... Oh, hey there, zombie scientist. Um... Hmm. I think we'll try. Ah, flaming eye. <laughs> of course. Of course. Uh, yeah. 
let's go this way a bit. <laughs> Not gonna try to go through the bush, are you? Ah, Skitterbot's back! God dang it, it hunted me down! <laughs> uh, that's not good. Yeah, this stuff just randomly popping out from the, uh, the lab. Sucks. Um... I am out in the middle of nowhere now. All right, let's get the skitterbot between me and the scientist. Oh, you guys aren't going to play together? That's not cool. Are they playing together yet? No, I don't think they are. Um, yeah, this is not good. Hmm. Let's um try to magic missile skitterbot. Don't usually have that many points. Oof, gonna take a lot. I'm gonna run out of stamina before I get this thing down. It's too fast. Look at that thing close in on me. Not sure why it stopped moving all of a sudden. I'll take it. <laughs> leg, leg, leg. Leg! What the hell, zombie? Yeah, no more running. Nothing useful. Still alive. Got a rat nearby. Go away, rat. Alright, so we're alive. Um, we got a flaming eye over there to the east. Like I said, it doesn't, doesn't look like they're going to do me the favor of putting the manhole cover out in the open. I only have a sample of one to finding one of these. Whoops! Ah, come on, man. If it's just going to be skitterbots everywhere. And zapped. I don't think this time I'm gonna be able to stay ahead of it. Yeah, this time it's actually getting on top of me and zapping me. Um, I don't know why it stopped moving last time, but I can't maintain enough of a lead. Nope, not gonna happen again. Stop sending skitterbots! And where did I drop my damn... <laughs> there it is. Took a lot less damage from the skitterbot than I thought I would. Alright, so... Yeah, this, the, the size of the area that it could be in is just so freaking big. 
That uh, flaming eye is like right here, so I can't afford to go south any further. It's just too much area to cover. Whoops. Bad dog. <laughs> uh. with a broken leg before I kill this guy. Well, or not. Lots of pain. Lots of slowdown. Alright. Well, we still haven't found anything remotely resembling a road. <laughs> um, where the hell did I leave my boat? I left my boat. I should have marked my boat. Was it down, like, over here? I think it was way over there. I saw a zombie soldier somewhere. There's the soldier. Not good. Um, he's going to be faster than me now. I don't know where near my boat. So far, I'm not really liking this start much. It's going to be way too slow to lose this guy. I don't have anything that's going to hurt him. Necrotic Gaze isn't going to do it. Something a zombie is not going to do it. Distracting with wildlife would be my only chance, and I don't see any wildlife nearby. Or lots of magic missile. Now he's going to start hitting me. Oh, it's multiple soldiers. Well... Where did that second guy come from? <laughs> I, was, I was just standing right here. So where exactly did the second guy... I think they're popping out of the ground again. I bet you they're popping up out of a barracks or something. Oh, I hate Z-Level so much. Yeah, there's, there's not really much. Do, 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 do. We'll run until I run out of stamina and they'll catch me. 
Oh, uh, look, a scientist has all of a sudden popped up as well. Yeah, they're just um, they're just popping up out of the ground. And hey, look, another skitterbot. <laughs> all right, I've had it. Oh. Uh... They weren't doing this nearly to this degree with the Z levels off. the the uh, The only thing I had seen it happen with was the um, the fungal. So no, there's no indicator. But we've had them just appear out of nowhere a couple of times now, and I've already been through and around a lot of these areas that they're all of a sudden just showing up in. Yeah, I'm already out of stamina. I, I would have made it to the boat if it hadn't been for the uh, the skitterbot. Yeah, there's really no point. Now I'm out of stamina. They're all going to catch me and kill me right here. And I'm winded even better. All right, so this guy's going to die. I'm going to I'm going to reveal the menu. <clears throat> reveal map, please. Show me this stupid map. How big is this lake? <laughs> I didn't even get to reveal that. I, I Apparently, I just hit a new uh, over map section. Ah, that's pretty funny. So we did have a big-ass city over there. How far over was that? So my starting island was here. So we got a chain of islands. <laughs> I was about to uh, I was about to boat ride into a Mego scout tower. <clears throat> that would have also ended me <laughs> as they shot me to death. Fungus. Not seeing anything down this way. Man, it's a lot of water. Alright, but more importantly, I, I don't really care about the rest of the map. Um, go below ground. Yep, there it is. So, theoretically... <laughs> oh, right there. Theoretically, right there. So we're going to teleport over there. Teleport, long range. Oh crap, where was it? I've forgotten now. Here? Right where the uh, airdrop crates were? Did I somehow miss it from here? Just south of me, theoretically. I don't know if... Oh, there it is! Right there. <laughs> oh, so close so I assume these are the trees that somebody had mentioned in chat the little triangle of trees but there's so many trees it's it's that that wouldn't have helped me find it any and having the trees like that means that trying to get a view on it from an angle is uh, really tough but yeah it was just uh, immediately south of where I picked up the uh the airdrop crates. So from where we first saw or heard things, we first heard gunfire out in the water over here. And it went all the way down, so it was like a like that. Which you can see. This is a central lab complex. Huge, huge, huge. And it goes down and down and down and down. <laughs> Level 8, level 9, level 10. <laughs> Can't go any deeper than that. One of these days, Central Lab Complex, I will actually get to you. As you can see, railways between these other uh, minor lab complexes, which are also hidden, apparently. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, they're, they're underground only, only accessible via the railway. There's no above ground uh, connection to them. So. Alright. Uh, this guy's dead, though. No way what, would I have survived the uh, skater bot. So soldier, soldier, scientist. World. I gotta think about this. So Rockerville, I am I'm really not pleased with um, 